Hey YouTube, welcome back. Uh, this is Mike from Mike's RC Corner today coming with you with not an RC product but one that will help you in your hobby. I found this to be a very helpful tool. This is the Ryobi Tech 4 cordless screwdriver, a powered screwdriver. It's 4 volt uh, battery inside of it. Um, I find this to be very helpful tool when wrenching it makes the wrenching part of the hobby much more enjoyable I remember getting into the hobby a few years ago and wasn't used to wrenching on things yet and my friend who was into the hobby for 20 plus years told me to make this in a more enjoyable experience is to have good tools and I couldn't stress it after I bought this because it can be tiring tedious turning screwdrivers and hex drivers just a quick look at this tool. Um, first of all, I think I purchased it for about $30 Canadian at a Home Depot near my home. Um, very much like a cordless drill. Uh, you have your screw settings, the, the ratchetness of it, high and low speed, uh, forward reverse. Uh, has a light, which is handy for getting into those dark spaces when you're um, wrenching on your RC. Um, the bottom cap screws off, battery comes out, can go into the charger they provide, fits in quite well, it takes a couple hours probably to charge up. I must say this battery has lasts forever. I have, I can, don't have to worry about charging it probably once every couple months. I'm not a heavy, heavy user, so maybe a more heavy user once every three, four weeks. But I'm very satisfied with this. And the best part about this is dialing the settings. You can tighten your hexes, screws, and not worry about stripping the screws. And it has just a nice torque to it that it's not over torquing. And it's also handy, also, you can use around the house. I wouldn't recommend screwing your deck with this, a new deck down, but. If you need a simple drill into the wall or something to hang a picture, this will easily do the trick. Now, one thing I did purchase for this is these hardened hex bits from Afna. Um, I was fairly satisfied with these bits until a couple weeks ago when my 1.5 millimeter uh, bit snapped at the head here. Um, that was a little frustrating, but these give you plenty of length and able to get into some tight spots on an RC. So if I was to give this a review, I give it five stars. I know there's other ones out there, but I've tried some. I found some cheaper ones and they had less settings and it was all about the torque and they didn't work near as well as this one did. So I highly recommend it. I think it's worth the money give you a better time wrenching and less time wrenching means more time running in my books hope you like this review um, hope you found it informational um, looking for likes and subscribers I hope you like what I'm bringing to you in this channel and um, we'll be on the lookout for more videos like this one thanks guys and we'll catch you next time